Hey guys, it is Freshly Squeezed Gaming here, and today I'm going to be doing another countdown video. And today I'm going to be sharing with you guys the top five most overpowered slash worst Mario Kart items. So yeah, guys, I'm doing two top fives in one video. I have done this type of style before where I do two top fives in one video. So yeah. The first top five we'll be doing is the top five most overpowered Mario Kart items, in my opinion. So yeah, guys, let's get to that list. So guys, at number five, for the most overpowered, I have the Mega Mushroom. So this is a Mario Classic item, but was introduced in Mario Kart Wii, but hasn't really appeared since, and it'd be pretty cool if this appeared again, because Mega Mushroom is a very cool item, and it is pretty overpowered, so pretty much you get it, and you turn huge, and you're able to run over other players. It's pretty annoying getting run over, but it's really fun to have the Mega Mushroom in Mario Kart Wii. So yeah, that is number five. So now let's get to number four. So number four is the Lightning Bolt. This item is also pretty powerful, but instead of turning huge yourself, you make the others turn very small, and yeah, pretty much the other players go very slow, and you're able to pass them pretty easily. This is a very overpowered item, but I do think three other items are more powerful than this item. So yeah, let's go on to number three. So guys, number three is the Crazy 8 slash Lucky 7. Pretty much, I'm putting these two at the same spot because they're pretty much the same thing except for the coin, which doesn't do anything <laughs> in terms of the race. But yeah, this item is very, very powerful. It has lots of items, including the banana, green shell, red shell, blooper, star, bob bomb, just lots of lots of items. The items themselves aren't very good, but if you put them all together into one item, <laughs> becomes a pretty powerful item and... This item is very rare and for good reasons. But yeah, guys, let's get on to number two. So guys, number two is the golden mushroom. Pretty sure you, you guys saw this one coming. The golden mushroom is extremely overpowerful. It's pretty much just a ton of mushrooms. You can just spam it and spam it and just keep on going. It makes you go really fast and using I've used this item in the past and I've caught up to, from like, I don't even know, like one of the worst places to one of the best. This item is insanely overpowered, but I think there's just one that is more overpowered than this item. But before we get to that one, let's get to the honorable mentions for this list. So the first honorable mention on this list is the triple red shell. This item is pretty overpowered. Um, I mean, <laughs> it's three red shells. Red shells are pretty good item just on itself and <laughs> you can knock out the um, first three people in front of you with this item pretty powerful you can skip three places with just one item that's pretty good and it definitely cracks the honorable mention um, tier for this list so the other honorable mention for this list is the pow block this item is pretty overpowered <laughs> you can pretty much knock out you do pretty much knock out every single racer <laughs> in in your race and you spin them out and yeah it's pretty powerful it can be annoying it can be very annoying for the person receiving the power block but if you get the power block you feel pretty good because you have all the power in your hands so yeah guys now let's get to the number one most powerful item on the list so guys, number one is the bullet bill. This is easily the most overpowered item in Mario Kart history. <laughs> so pretty much people in like 11th and 12th place get this item and they catch up to the front of the pack, usually in like within the top five. Like this item is insanely powerful. <laughs> it's great for people who are in um, last place, like I said. But yeah, guys, this is the most overpowered item in Mario Kart history, in my opinion, the Bullet Bill. So now let's get to the top five worst items in Mario Kart, starting with number five. So guys, this one might be a little bit controversial, but the number five worst Mario Kart item, in my opinion, is the Banana Peel. 
This one is a classic. This is about the most classic item in Mario Kart history, along with the green shell and the mushroom. I think the banana, green shell, and mushroom are the three most classic items in Mario Kart history. And I think this one is one of the worst because it just doesn't really do anything. You just put it down and most of the time people just go around it and avoid it. Every once in a while you have that person who runs and just into just one single banana. But obviously the triple banana is a lot better, but it's just a single banana. It's pretty much worthless. So yeah, it's just my opinion. So yeah, now let's get on to number four. So guys, number four is the blooper. Now, I've seen other um, videos with the best and worst Mario Kart items. Usually people put this one closer to number one, but this item isn't all too bad. Yeah, you can see through the ink on the screen, but the item does have a purpose. It puts um, ink on the screen so you can't see where you're going, but even though you kind of can, but th this is a definitely a flawed item, but I do not think it, it d deserves to be in the top three. It, I don't think it's top three worthy. It is flawed. I think there should be a lot more ink on the screen than there usually is. But yeah, guys, I think the top three is a lot worse. I dreadfully hate these <laughs> these next three items on this list. So yeah, let's get to number three. So guys, number three is the fake item box. I do not like this item at all because it just doesn't serve its purpose well. It's... <laughs> It's a fake item box, but it's red. Now, I know in older Mario Karts, like in Mario Kart 64, fake item box looks exactly like the real item box, but I'm talking about the newer games, and just the, <laughs> the item's pointless. Like, I know it's not in Mario Kart 8, but the, just this item is just terrible. It's just a fake item box. I, I don't know. I, I don't know what else to say. I'm kind of speechless. It's just, it just doesn't look like an item box. It's easy to avoid. Just, I don't, I don't really know what else to say, guys. So, let's get on to number two. Number two is the coin. This is literally the most useless item in Mario Kart history. This literally does absolutely nothing for your race except give you, give it gives you a small little boost, but that doesn't even matter. When I get an item, when I get an item box, I'm expecting to get an item that will help me with my race, not a freaking coin. The, co <laughs> the coin is not meant to be an item. It's supposed to be something that's on the track for you to collect throughout the race. The coin being an item is literally the most useless thing ever, but there is an item that's somehow worse than the coin. But before I get to that item, let's get on to the honorable mentions for this list. So guys, the first honorable mention is the Super Leaf. Now, this item can sometimes can sometimes be a little bit eh. I don't know. I don't know how to describe it. Just sometimes meh. But um, yeah, if you do have a racer next to you or behind you, in front of you or somewhere, you can pretty much swing them with your tail. But I don't know. This item's very unusual. It's just pretty much a little tail on the back of your cart, and you swing at other players to try to knock them out. It's just very unusual, but I don't I don't think it's in the top five worst. It barely, barely cra cracks the honorable mention. I, I almost put it on this list, but yeah. The other honorable mention for the worst list is the green shell. Now, this is another classic along with the banana, but again, this item is also weak like the banana, but it is better because you can actually snipe people. I mean, you could with the banana, but like, it's just, eh, meh. But the green shell is definitely a lot better than the banana, but it is still one of the worst and does not crack the worst list. But yeah, guys, let's, let's now get on to the worst Mario Kart item. So guys, the worst Mario Kart item is the Thunder Cloud. This is the only item that is against you, you, the player that got the item. Like, how does that make sense? Items are supposed to be used in favor of yourself. This item is against you. It wants you out. If you get the thundercloud, you have to pass it to another player or you're going to shrink. Um, so this is pretty much a worse, a, a by far worse version of the lightning bolt. Except, except <laughs> the lightning bolt strikes everyone. And this item, the, it's the complete opposite of the lightning bolt. It strikes you. It wants you out. This item sucks. 
<laughs> so guys, <laughs> oh my gosh, this is the worst item in Mario Kart history, the Thundercloud. So yeah guys, that's going to be it for this video. Hope you guys enjoyed watching me <laughs> talk about the top 5 most overpowered items and the top 5 worst items in Mario Kart history. So yeah, hope you guys enjoyed the video. Like, comment, and subscribe. See you guys next time. Bye-bye.